Hello everyone, this is DJ Dimaliwat and welcome to Project Six Figures. And today with me is a very good friend, si Rich Paredes, one of the co-founders of VIP International. He's a network marketer. And we met in no, 2016. It was in Malaysia pa yon, no? in, a, in a training that we attended together. And then mm -hmm. since then, we've been very good friends and part of the speaker circle here. Uh, uh, a really close-knit group here in the Philippines. Group of entrepreneurs, diba? And you know, we we visit our he visits our office, we visit them their office and their house as well. Ganyan. and then, and of course helping one another. Meron din siyang show by the way, uh, VIP TV. No, yeah. where nagigest din ako and then a lot of different entrepreneurs as well. They have a Facebook page, diba? And we're here, no, para of course to hear his story and to learn something from him. But I believe it's best if siya na yung mag-introduce sa sarili niya about his background and what he's doing. So. Bro, can you tell us what you do and a bit of your background? So take it away. Parang kinabahan ako bigla. So anyway, uh, first of all, DJ, thanks so much for ano, ha? For uh, having me here, and alam mo, it's uh, it's really a pleasure to really uh, get in touch with uh, entrepreneurs like you, and just ano, just bonding. Na miss ko na yung bonding moments natin. Oh. Eh. So for everyone who's watching, yeah, my name's Rich uh, Paredes. Um, I'm I'm an author, I'm a speaker, and uh, I'm the co-founder and CEO of VIP International. There we have an online and offline platform where you can make money part-time or home-based. So, if you're interested with something like that, we'd love to share that to you. And like what uh, DJ said, uh, I'm a network marketer, and I love and whoa, you know, and I love being a network marketer because I know it doesn't just it doesn't just uh, give the opportunity to make money, but also the opportunity to grow, and that's what nice. I love. So, you grow as a person. Of course. Right. How many years have you been doing this? My God, <laughs> I've been doing this for quite some time. Since? Um, I've been doing this, I started 1999. Okay. I started 1999, okay. but I was literally clueless what network marketing is pa noon time na yon. I just, you know, the typical, you were invited to a company, there was a presentation, there was like a, a lot of ra ra ra, la, a lot of hype and energy. Yeah. But I love the environment immediately. That's what okay. I love. Okay. But what, that was 1999. Wala pang ako alam. But I, I took it seriously. Take note, ha? I took it seriously. 2006. Okay. Oh. oh. So, so in seven years, pag ganyan ganyan lang. Wala. <laughs> um, ang tawag sa amin ng time niyon, fans club. <laughs> okay, talaga. Fans club. Grabe, lang ako. Yeah. So ako, I was uh, I was attending presentations. I was looking. Alam mo yon, I was being inspired by uh, other people, and that's where I actually met my wife. Sa, yeah. Sa si baby. Ito. Oh, si baby. Yeah, nagyas na rin charito sa ano natin sa show natin. Ay, buti naman. Oh. Okay. <laughs> ano? <laughs> Di mo pa na noo da? Kung sa sabi na nag <laughs> nag ano ha? Nagsesyon na tayong yon. Pero <laughs> <laughs> So, pero na, na, seven years. Doon mo siya na-meet, pero seven years kang fans club lang ni Baby. Karang ganon. Yeah, man. <laughs> I mean, not, just, not just Baby. By the way, my wife is a really, alam mo yan, she's a really, really good trainer. And noong time na yun, when, uh, kaya ako talaga naging fan ni Baby kasi extraordinary yung ano niya nun eh, yung result niya. Yeah, yeah. So, alam ko that na parang, wow, this, this, this lady is amazing. This girl is amazing. So, Sabi ko, may kasabihan nga, the fastest way to become a millionaire is to marry a millionaire. <laughs> so, ikaw yun. Yun ang matututunan natin sa'yo, no? Oo. Oh, gusto niyo mabilisan? Oo. Oh, oh. Kasawahin mo mayaman. <laughs> Pwede. <laughs> ang galing, ang galing. Ibang klase ka. Ibang klase ka talaga. <laughs> Joke lang, kamakay mo mga iba. Ma'am Rospect na mamaya. Oh, malay mo, di ba? O kaya dito, na mo mag-shopping sa mga ini-interview natin. <laughs> Wow, but again, um, kidding aside, going yeah. back 1999, before you joined the industry, ano yung ginagawa mo before? Um, freshly, ano ako, working student ako nun. So, okay. I was studying, um, tapos nag, uh, nagpa-part-time ako sa ano, alayo ng background ko eh. Wala talaga akong, 
hindi ko naisip na pumasok sa ganito. Okay. Pero ang ang gusto ko talaga before gawin is mostly on the arts, sa side okay. ng art. And I was involved in ano, theater. <laughs> okay? So medyo, okay. sorry ah, nagugulat na yung mga iba. Artista ka pala? Naku, patay tayo doon. Hindi, ano ako, uh, background. Okay. <laughs> ako yung production. So okay. I, I had that, um, nagkaroon ako ng, ano, ng passion with, ano, with sa, sa events sa okay. ano sa sa filmmaking sa pero more on sa background ako background okay I do okay. lights I do sounds I okay. do props so okay. that was my ano that was my part time okay nag-aaral ako noon so I was more active on that tapos uh, I if not if I'm not mistaken it was a good four years na yun ang ginagawa ko okay okay and then before you graduated you got invited in the industry actually uh not before after i graduated oh so you when you graduate oh yeah, so after i graduated um ang nag-invite sa akin actually kuya ko brother ko okay okay brother kuya mo kuya, yeah. wala kang choice eh. wala kang <laughs> so, okay so, hindi ko talaga siya ano hindi ko parang ina- inatak niya lang ako sabi niya the usual invite eh, yung brother ko na yun nung time na yun he was starting by that time rin okay so, invited me sabi niya ang ang invite niya nga sa akin napaka ano eh Oy, sumama ka. <laughs> Di ba? <laughs> Pasapilitan. Pasapilitan. Sabi ng kuya, sumama, sama ako. Okay. So, but one of the thing is, nung, nung umatind ako nung seminar, it's a typical seminar, yeah. I was blown away with the stories. I was blown yeah. away with the environment, like what I said. Yeah. I was blown away with the opportunity okay, to make that much money. Kasi nung time na yun, my mindset is just to get the job. Yeah. Na, and alam mo yon work however i can just to alam mo yon parang just to, just to get by yeah yon just to get by pero ako nga iniisip ko 20,000 30,000 masaya na ako noon yeah. eh. makikita yeah. ko na 1,000 na peso na job masayang masaya na ako noon eh but after going to that kind of seminar it literally opened up yung yung pangarap eh and yeah, that tama. I feel a lot of people hindi kasi dumadaan sa ganung process Tama, tama. Lot of people tumatanda minsan pag tinanong mo kung ano pangarap nila basically asking the what they want they still don't know yeah yeah and they will always go back to the default nasasabihin lang nila kumain lang ako tatlong beses isang araw masaya na ako yeah. just that is what uh, majority of the people that's what they think that's tama, how tama. They, by the way so, because it, maybe that's how they raised, eh, no? And in school, minsan, hindi man lang nga pinag-uusapan ano yung pangarap mo or not too much. Sometimes mayroon, eh. Actually, mayroon minsan, pero not too much or hindi alam kung paano dalahin nung teacher, gano'n. Tama. Hindi kasi alam kung paano, hindi pa, hindi alam kung paano dalhin. Hindi rin alam kung paano palabasin. Yeah, yun, paano hugutin from them. Yeah. Tama, parang paano mo, ano, ano mo pangarap mo? Tapos yeah. nagsabi, ako doktor, uh, aral ka pa. <laughs> no, parang gano'n agad eh. Oh. Okay. So, yun, yun yung time, uh, I remember this, uh, that was 1999. First time kong umatin nun, that was uh, mid, ano yun eh, um, around October. Grabe yung ano ko nun, yung 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 moment na yun na parang namulat ako. Sabi ko nga doon sa kuya ko, parang may ganito palang mundo. Okay. Hindi ko alam. And by the way, nung time na yun, I was really really afraid kasi on going into sales. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, I know one of the reasons why I was afraid of it. Bakit? That time, it's because of status and peer pressure nung time na yun. Okay, okay. Nalaman, parang tropa. Yeah, yeah. Pag- tropa, tropa. Na pag nalaman, meron kang binibenta. Oh, benta-benta. Yeah, so, yeah. Parang, kaya nag-shy away yung mga batch natin. <laughs> yung mga batch natin eh. Yung mga batch Dinamay natin. Dinamay mo ba ako ah? <laughs> <laughs> oh, na, fine. <laughs> Pero, I can say, doon sa mga, ano ko, doon sa mga batch ko, kaya marami hindi nag-business, naging entrepreneur because of ayaw nilang mabansagan. Tama, na tama. Parang, eh, si benta-benta to, sinigo-negosyo, kung yeah, ano yeah. mo. Tama, that, tama. That was a real thing ah. Totoo, totoo. Unlike now, marami ngayon. Pag nag- open eh. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Open, open na ngayon eh. Pero yeah. dun, yun yung minsan nagiging problema, hindi na ba-value nung iba. Tama, tama. Yeah, yeah, tama. So, eh ako pinagdaanan ko rin yung bro eh. No? Na parang, eh, nung sa college pa lang ako, nag-start ako mag- 
offer. Nag, ang pinaka natatawa ako dun sa popcorn eh. Nagbeta ako ng popcorn tapos, ay may nakakahiya, di ba? Pero wala oh. eh. Kailangan or gusto ko eh. Parang I wanna learn from that. I wanna grow eh. So, ginet buy ko yun. Hanggang ngayon, may isang biruan pa rin yun eh. Mga oh. prof ko, no? Na, ay, si DJ, nung ano, nagbeta ng popcorn. Gano. So, parang, yun nga, when you're doing something na out of the ordinary, parang pinagtatawanan, ganyan. So, yeah. yun yung naging pressure sa'yo. No, kaya yes. parang ayaw mo. But you know, you saw something na something big. No, yeah. Na-open yung mind mo, eh, di ba? Na, nabuksan yung pangarap, yun nga yung sinabi mo, di ba? Tapos you like the environment, the stories. That's yes. why you stayed. But yun nga, sabi mo, you, you just cruised along for seven years. Di ba? You cruised along for seven years. What made you shift? No, bakit noong 2006? Okay, sige. Parang nagkaroon na ng, ng shift na. O sige, seryosohin ko na to. Uh, actually, Um, you you you've just said it. Nung yung seven years na yon, I f- I felt that I was not serious. Obviously, okay. yeah. for seven years, parang alam mo yung um, one of the things kaya siguro hindi ako naging seryoso kasi on a certain level may may ano yung uh, yung comfort zone was there. Yeah. Um, kasi by that time, meron kaming business. May, may family business kami that was still uh, running. Yung time na yun, it was a security agency. Mm-hmm. So, I was getting a little bit of, of ano doon, compensation. Okay, okay. Without okay. even doing anything. So, parang so, may, may share, ganyan. Share ako doon. So, syempre, alam mo naman minsan, alam mo naman minsan, dal anak ka. <laughs> mm-hmm. Share ka. Alam mo yung ganun. Uh, uh. Which is, obviously, now that we have... Uh, kids of our own. Alam natin na hindi dapat go anywhere pag yeah, yeah, yeah. pato natin sa mga anak natin. So, mas gusto ko pahirapan yung mga anak natin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Pero, noong time na yun, seven years, I was uh, slightly compensated. But the thing is, I was parang hindi ko naisip na, go, na gawin siyang seryoso. Yeah, yeah. The comfort zone. But the thing is, pare, noong time that the business was going down, that hit me pretty hard. Okay. As in... Business nyo, yung, yung business family business nyo. Okay. Family business, ha? When, when, when the business was not doing any any good, doon na yun. Doon na yung medyo nararamdaman na. Iba na eh. Okay. okay. Iba na yung pakiramdam. Yeah. I always share this to people. It's okay na pinanganak ka na mahirap. Alright? Kasi kung mahirap ka ngayon, walang change. Yeah. Walang adjustment. Yeah. Kung pinanganak ka naman mahirap at umamang ka, kudos for you. Ibig yeah. sabihin, maganda na yung, maganda, tama yung ginawa mo. Tama. Pero kung mayaman ka or may pera ka before at humirap ka, yeah. that is yeah. the biggest change. That's true. Mahirap yun. Napakahirap. Mas mahirap yun. Oh. Then, I'm not saying we're really well off, bro. Hindi kami sobrang yaman, but I know my mom and my dad really, really gave us a really, a really good, a good life. life. Yeah. It's yeah. really good life. The thing is, this was the, 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 the problem. Uh, we, with with what they gave us, it was too good of a life that they forgot that we need to go through a lot of challenges to excel. Okay, okay. So dumating yung time na hindi kami. Ano yun? Sobrang sobrang ang ang. I mean, imagine mo ah, eight years old, nine years old, na na pa na na sama nila sa Amerika. Yeah, yeah. And that time, man, ang, ang ticket papuntang Amerika, parang isang daan libo ata. Oh, mas mahal before. Mahal. Oh. Pacific noon. Oh. Okay. So, ngayon, thinking about it, wow, it was a real privilege yeah, na tama. experience ko yun. So, kung baga may kaya yung family talaga. So, oh, talaga. Eh, minsan may maling, may maling impact sa anak, no? Parang ganun yung nangyayari. Eh, pare, ang nangyayari sa akin, nandun doon, maganda yung buhay, maayos, nakakain kami ng ma- masarap yung nakakain na. Yeah wala. Okay. And that was hard. Oh, yeah, yeah. My, and and uh, by that time, uh, girlfriend ko nun si Baby, um, she she helped me a lot through that time. Kasi, alam mo naman, Baby is really a very good trainer, a very yeah. good motivator. And that time, I was really down financially, emotionally. Oh my God, man. Hindi ko alam ko ano yung ano nang taso. I, we needed, I, I needed to sell things para makabang move on. Nice. Grabe. <clears throat> Sabi ko nga, and I always tell this to people, the reason, one of the reasons why I want to become really, 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 really wealthy is because 
one of the things I ayoko nang paranas ayoko maranas yung maranasan yun ng anak ko ng family ko at anyone who's in my circle ayoko maranasan yun because it's really really hard and I'm a lot of people sometimes nagiging naive tayo na eh pagyaman pagyaman ganyan I have to tell you guys napakasarap ng buhay na may pera tama <clears throat> napakasarap ng buhay na may pera kasi mas marami kang nagagawa tama you can freedom eh. it it buys freedom eh. uh, freedom of to do what you want exactly yeah. and and it doesn't restrict you to health yeah yun yung mahalaga eh. kasi alam, alam mo tayo mga tao we have a good heart eh. i believe in that oh. we really have that helping we have the heart to help however nagkakaroon ng parang di ba pag kapos na kapos syempre ikaw muna I gusto mo ikaw muna ganun nangyayari so dapat ipigilan na yung natural na na love to help people love for people di ba so but when you're overflowing with blessings it's easier to help eh di ba you don't even think about it you don't yeah, even tama. think about just giving, helping and then alam mo yon I, I i remember the the, the times na Kunyari, Mimo, ay, until na marami pa naman ito, mga malingos, may lalapit sa'yo, yeah. ha? parang kakalabitin ka ng bata, yung bariya. Alam mo yung ganon? Yeah, yeah. Pare, even before they talk, I give something. But I remember there was a time na talagang down na down ako noon. I was, alam mo, doon yung ko na-realize. Oo, oh, mag-iisip ka eh, no? Mag-iisip ka eh. Alam mo yun, ano, bibigyan ko to, hindi ako makakauwi. Alam mo yung ganon? Tama, tama, tama. But, doon ko na-realize na I really need to do something with my life. I really need to do something with 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 this God-given talent. Lahat naman tayo may talent. Yeah, Lahat yeah, yeah. Opportunity to grow. Lahat tayo may opportunity to become better, stronger, smarter. But the thing is people don't take that advantage. And when you lose that moment, I won't kung kailan pa makukuha ulit 'yun. Tama. Until you lost that, eh, diba? And in nga eh, sometimes that that that's that's where where and when the shift happened for you diba when when something lost from your family oh. and, and minsan yun yung masama na parang may kailangan pang mangyaring ganun before we started to act diba exactly. so maybe it's also a lesson and it's a privilege to hear this story from you bro at least it reminds people na ah okay wag nang hintayin yung ganun no if if you're well off right now or somehow at least comfortable yeah diba? do something to grow more kasi Pag nawala yan, ang hirap eh. Correct. <clears throat> diba? Na, yun nga eh, ang, ang ganda nun si Raimo, ang hirap nun, ang bigat nun, na meron ka, tapos di ka yung nawalan. Mas mabigat yun. Mas mabigat. Sinasanay ka na eh. And what, one thing that uh, I, I, ano, uh, I realized, noong time na yun, when I, when I was um, thinking about the, the years, na, uh, so noong time na yun, wala naman nag-guide talaga sa atin eh. Yeah. So, yeah. Yun, yun, eh, wala talaga nag-guide, wala naman kumakalabit sa atin na parang, hoy, dapat ganito, dapat ganyan. Wala. I didn't get any, anything of that. That's why I needed to source out Alam mo yun, I needed to source out that somebody can teach me, somebody can, ano. Yeah. And one thing that I realized noong time na yon, which is, I changed this, ito particularly this, I was not grateful noong time na yon. Okay. That is Tama. something na, alam mo yun, verbally, now I'm saying it, kasi I realized that my life, the reason why my life was not getting any better, be, kasi hindi ako grateful noong time na yon. Okay. And after all of the stuff happened, o nga no, small things, big things, when you're in lack, dapat grateful ka pa rin. Tama, and tama. And you not develop one. Until now, man, whether I have money or not, I'm grateful. Tama, tama. That's one of the secrets eh, and, and character of successful people. Yes. Diba? Choose, choose gratitude na lang kasi lagi lahat naman may problema eh. Lahat naman may hindi maganda nangyayari. You have but there's... To- and yeah. ako, eh, dagdag ko lang, you have to, we have to be grateful if there's problems. Yeah. Kasi ako naniniwala ako, problems makes us stronger eh. That's Yun true. Naniniwala ako eh. Pag naiikita yeah. ko, the, be- the bigger the problem, wow, the bigger the growth. Tama, tama. I expected tama. ako dyan eh. And I, I got this from my wife. My wife always reminds me na, pag if there's a problem, let's embrace it. And I see her face. She's like, ganun siya eh. Game on. Yeah, yeah, But yeah. Pag naiikita ko, yan ang gusto ko eh. Okay. At hindi yung problema. Wow! Doon ako nababaliw dyan sa asawa ko eh. Ibang klase, no? Ibang klase yung asawa ko, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Pag natulog ako yan, sinisipa ako niyan. <laughs> Sasabihin eh, tama yun, no? Tama yun. Sa akin, sasabihin niya sa akin, wala ka pang ginagawa niyan. Hintayin mo pag may ginawa ka din. <laughs> <laughs> Iba talaga, matapang talaga si baby eh. 
Pero yeah, it, it helps in life as well, no? Na, yeah. nga, it's either magpapatalo ka ba dun sa problems or challenges. Kasi there will always be problems and challenges, di ba? You cannot just be always comfortable. Yeah. But yun nga, it's either you look at it as problem, ito na naman, pahirap to, ayoko na, or this is really something. Yun nga, I'm excited kasi mas mag-grow ako. Yeah. Pag na-overcome ko to, what can I do more? Parang ganun eh. What life can I have? Correct. What person can I become? And I think that's what happened to you. Di ba? You yeah. just cruised along for the past seven years because it's too comfortable. Correct. But probably after that, something that, that big change has happened that made you decide. And right. when, when, you, when you decided, like 20, 2006, no, 2006, how long did it take para talagang kumita ka ng maigid dyan sa negosyo? Okay, very good question. Uh, when we decided, 2006, we decided to, to look for a, net, a, a network marketing company. Like okay. we searched. Kasi, um, I remember this, uh, this, ano, um, this was an advice from a very good friend of ours, si Lilet. And um, um, she's, uh, kilala mo yun yung singer before na ano. Okay. Hero pa rin pala ngayon na, sorry, singer before. <laughs> barkada ko, barkada namin yun. So, I remembered kasi when we were, kami ni Baby noon, uh, when we were a bit struggling, kasi we were doing, we, we just, uh, no, we just, fin- ato, we just closed down a business noong time na yun. Tapos, uh, ako nagsa-struggle ako noon na, ano, kaya sabihin eh, pero nagsa-struggle ako, nagbabanda ako dati. Okay. So, feeling ko, feeling ko, magaling ako. <laughs> okay, feeling ko, magaling ako. So, anyway, so we were struggling noon, the business was not doing good. Then I remembered, uh, yung si Lilet, sabi nga sa amin, ano ba ginagawa nyo before? Sinabi niya to kay baby, sinabi niya okay. sa amin. Ano ba ginagawa nyo before? Sabi ko, nag-network kami. Bakit hindi niyo balikan kung saan kayo passionate at magaling? Okay. Nung sinabi niyo, parang wow. O nga, no? For Basta tumigil kayo. Tumigil kami eh. Kasi okay, okay. after like, uh, that was uh, 1999, after like two years, three years, we stopped. So, okay. meron kaming three-year gap na okay. we were exploring in business. Okay, okay. Na, traditional business. Ayaw traditional. Ayaw uh, school. Okay. Ayaw kami ng, ano, ng school for, ano, for call centers. Imagine okay, mo. Okay, yeah, yeah. Yun yeah. Yun, okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay? There was a, there was a need. So yeah, yeah. Need. Now, going fast forward, uh, sinabi sa amin na maganap ng ano, sinabi sa amin, why not go back to something that you're passionate with that you that you found success before. Yeah. Sabi kay baby, and by that time, I didn't get any success with that. But, but, take note guys, I believed in the system. Yeah, I believed yeah. In the industry. That's why it was easy for me to, oh nga no. Okay. Yeah. So, we found that company, syempre, honestly man, we were so excited. We were so we we are really excited on time na yon. Chills. Literally, kami ni baby. We were we were married by that time already. Okay. We were we were nasa nasa kama kami. Um, lights were out. And literally, bro. We didn't know, but we were. I was hearing her. She was hearing me. We were both crying. Because when we saw that, kasi. Sometimes kasi you have, you, you would know if it's the right decision kasi okay. you feel it inside okay. your bones, your body. You will, yung chill mo na excitement, iba. So we were literally crying about it. Umiiyak kami nun. Sabi ko, eto na yun. We, this okay. is what we're praying for. And to make, the, to make the long story short, when we, when we went to that company, literally spearheaded it. Bro, the first, the first um, six figures that we got, if I'm not mistaken, ah, I, I, medyo ano pa ako nun, medyo blurry pa. No Kasi hindi, I, was, I wasn't really thinking about the timeline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. About the goal. Yeah, yeah. Di ba, minsan may ganun na tao. Tama, yung, tama. Yung, 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 ako kasi yung goal namin. Goal lang, yun. yeah. Tama, ganun naman. So, if I'm not mistaken, um, less, I think less than four, okay, four months, we were able to get that. Wow. The first, wow. first uh, six figures. And that was the time that I really, really decided that I will make this as a profession. Okay. Okay. And, and sometimes, Tama. a lot of business people, they haven't decided yet. Eh. They wanted to get into something because it's making money. Tama, tama. Getting into something with, with, with you choosing it. Alam mo yun, choosing it na ito gagawin ko, 
I'm gonna make a career that I'm gonna develop myself. Yeah. Kasi ay grabe yon yung time na yon. Dapat may ganun eh no. Hindi pwedeng pera lang talaga habol mo eh no. Kasi you also have to develop yourself katumbas ng pera eh. Dapat ganun eh. Right. Yeah. That time ah, that time with eto for everyone who's watching. But that time we didn't ako honestly on my part. My wife is 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 a, a professional by that time. Yeah, okay? yeah, yeah. Already even before from that company, okay? Tama. But ako kasi nung first time ko nag decision na yon that I literally say that is my first serious company. Okay. Time na yon. Okay. And when I got into that, talagang bro binuhos ko talaga yung yung galing, binuhos ko yung and literally I didn't know what I was doing, ha. <laughs> hindi pa ako no no. Uh-huh. Hindi pa ako planchado noon, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hindi pa ako ganun, hindi pa hindi pa ako magaling magsalita. And even now, hindi ko naman kiniklaim na magaling ako. Ina- Pero mas ano pa before, oh. Oo, oo, raw pa before, raw talent pa before, yo. Oh my God, hindi ko alam kung ano sinasabi ko. Ang dami. <laughs> ang dami. Yeah, yeah. Ang daming kalat. Yeah, kung baga, yeah. if, siguro kung manood ka sa akin before, kailangan mo magdala ng walis. Kasi ang daming <laughs> mong wawalis na kalat. Kasi yeah. ang dami magsalita, iba yung, iba yung energy ko pa noon. Yeah, but, yeah. but I learned. And then the one of the thing uh, one of the key things that made me push myself more was actually from ayoko na sabihin kung sino but it was a person there inside the company that made me realize that I in order to get good people in order to get real leaders you have to be the leader okay yeah tama tama in, in order for you to get and close be, bigger people you have to be the bigger person. The big person, yeah. Tama, tama. And, and it really, when, when I heard about this, talagang iba bro, as in talagang pinanggigilang ko siya. Iyakin ako nun eh. Hanggang ngayon, iyakin pa rin ako eh. Pero iyak talaga ako nun. <laughs> okay. And I mean, I'm not, I'm not, uh, I always say to people, wala akong pakailang ko lalaki. Yeah, so, dapat so, naman ganun eh. eh. Kailangan big, big boy. Yeah, eh. hindi Pero, ganun. You know, when the emotion really takes over, and you're, when you're really passionate or what you know, just let out that emotion. And you know, nice. that moment, I really made a, a, a solid choice, a solid decision, rather, to make myself better. And that's wow. why it started, it started, it started. So, that moment na yun, bro, I never looked back. Never looked back since then. Uh, six figures a month or more every single month because of that. Yeah, that's Ang ganda nun. Thank you for that that sharing. And then what I saw there is really that moment of decision. Eh. No, na you want to be better. Eh. That's that that realization na, okay, gusto ko to, pero kailangan ko mag-grow. Yeah. Dapat both eh. Di ba? Yeah. Dapat both eh. Dapat clean, clear ka rin anong gusto mong ma-achieve eh. No, that, that certain goal eh. And what I like is you you make that decision na, okay, kakaririn ko to. I will make this my career. Hindi to, try lang. Alam mo yun. Sige na nga, baka pag nag-work, okay. Or nakakahiya, yeah. hindi eh. Diba? Ano, naalala ko, yung tama yung sinasabi mo. Kasi may mga iba kasi, parang I'll try. So, yeah, ganun eh. Uh, what if you fail? Tapos na. Yeah. And oh, I, I oh. always hear this in seminars in network marketing companies. I yeah. always share this, ano, yung, yung keys of commitment. Eh. Pero yeah. bottom line, it's true eh. If you Totoo. just try, oh. and when you fail, you stop. Oh, okay lang. Kasi try lang eh. Try lang diba? eh. Oo eh. Diba naman, sinasabi, I'll try my, my best. What if your best wasn't good enough? Naka yeah. na, makakanda, no? Yeah. Bottom line, bottom line, o nga, no, minsan yung iba yung best mo, baka hindi best ng iba. Tama, baka yung tama. Baka yung under of best mo, mababa masyado. Yeah, yeah. The best commitment of all is really doing it whatever it whatever takes. Whatever it takes. Tama. Oh. When you talk about whatever it takes, it literally whatever it takes. Magutumang ka, mapuyat ka, mapagod ka. If you needed to walk, you walk. And I, um, and I heard this from, from one of my mentors. If you can run, you run. If you can walk, you walk. If you can crawl, you crawl. Do whatever it takes until you get to the finish line. Even tama. if it's inch by inch, you do it. Oh, kasi tama. magkakaiba tayo ng, ano, eh, ng pacing. Eh. May mga tao talagang okay, medyo mapalad, mas mabilis sila ng konti. Ah. Di ba? Meron ka naman, posibleng mas mabagal ka. Pero you don't need to look at other people. Eh. You gotta look at your own story and your own pace. Basta wag ka lang titigil, di ba? And that is where the, the, the concept of you being in the marathon and yeah. not being in a sprint. Yeah. Hindi yeah. to papilisan, kapatid. Patakalan. Yeah. Tama, tama. Ako wala akong pakialam kung meron 
meron dyan yung mama na just in two months, three months, good for him. Yeah, yeah. Oh, more. Yeah, yeah. Good ko yan. Kasi everyone wants to, well, everyone, ako personally, I'm a, I'm a supporter of, ano talaga, of, of great stories. I'm a supporter of success. I'm a supporter yeah. of encouragements and giving value. Yeah. At the end of the day, are you consistent? Tama. Kasi bottom line, kailangan consistency pa rin eh. O kasi pag mabilis ka, tapos hindi ka rin, nat- yun, alam mo yun, nag-falter ka rin eventually. Hmm. Di ba? Pwede kang ma- ma- mawala yung success eh. O mag-dip eh. Ganun eh. Minsan ganun, medyo gumanyan. Oo. Oh. Oh. Pero ang key pa rin doon, kaya mo pa rin gumanyan. Oo. Oh. Tama. Tama. Parin, kasi, yung iba, gumanon, gumanyan, di na oh. <laughs> Alam mo nung dumiretso bro, natulog. <laughs> Iba eh. Yeah, yeah. Yung, um, sabi nga, di ba, eto, I mean, we're learners of Jim Rohn. Sabi nga ni yeah. Jim Rohn, di ba, it's okay to take a break but not the whole week. Yeah. But even God, ano, had one day to rest after creating yeah. the world for six days, seven days, nagpahinga. Rested, yeah. Tama. Diba? Yung iba, pare, never ever stop. Yung iba nagpahinga, namamahinga. <laughs> Natulog na. <laughs> Natulog na eh. Yeah. They want to be better. They want to be greater. Ang hirap. Yeah. Tama yun eh. Kasi life should be continuously growing and learning eh. Diba? Yeah, you rest and then you continuously grow and then you apply. Ganun talaga siya. And I think that's what I saw in you. Diba? Um, yeah, you might stop. Diba? But if you didn't give up dun sa goal and dun sa dream eh. And then oh. when you eventually decided, yun na nga, nagtuloy-tuloy na. And I, and I know, diba, you, eh, eh, we, we've known each other for the past four years. You've yeah. encountered challenges then, just like last year, diba? But right now, you you established a, a, a company of your own because yes. the dream is really there and bigger, diba? So what made you decide, no? To again take a bigger challenge and this time set up your own company. Wow, man, that is a uh, you know every time I uh, every time I get this question. Siyempre, hindi mo may iwasan nagre-reminisce ka eh. Doon sa pinag-aaman yeah. eh. Yeah. And honestly, um, I couldn't say that I was ready nung time na yon because I didn't see myself na I'd be an owner of a company. Yeah. That was the first thing. Who, everyone, if you, probably if you talk to entrepreneurs, mabilis nila sabihin, oh, gusto ko yan. Gusto ko may sarili akong business. Yeah. Totoo eh. But on my thinking kasi, ang kinakausap ko ang sarili ko nun, am I ready for this challenge. Kasi, always remember guys, when entering being, when you are an entrepreneur, you don't just think about that decision. You don't just do a decision because it only affects you. Yeah. Lagi mo tandaan, kasi as an entrepreneur, if you're employed, it affects you. Yun lang. Wala lang. Oh. Mo. Pero if you're an entrepreneur, every decision that we make affects us, the families, and the people that believes in you and that you're supporting. Do you agree, bro? Because we're building people. Eh. Yeah, we, have people yeah. we have a network of people. So every decision really counts, not just for me, but for the people who is under my leadership, yeah. under my team. So, noong time na yun, grabe talaga, Brad. Hindi talaga kami re. Ako personally, hindi ako ready mentally. But uh, the good thing about this, the good thing about this is, the first move that I did, I talked to capable and well, ano, uh, well-learned entrepreneurs. Okay. So yun ang una kong ginawa. Nag-seek advice muna. Ako. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Pri- prior from, of course, syempre, I prayed for it. Okay, I, I asked 100% yan. You pray for it, you ask for signs, okay? Then you talk to people of, of ano talaga, yung, yung alam. Huwag kayo humingi lang ng advice kung kani-kanino. Kung kani-kanino, o, oh, syempre. Hindi natin yung nagiging problema ng Pinoy eh. Hingi ng advice. Hingi ng advice dun sa kanto boy. O di, anong bibigay sa'yo ng information yan? Wala. Uh, di ba? You have to ask people na capable, na, na, na bigyan ka ng tamang sagot. So, I, I'm very blessed kasi dun sa circle natin, pare, ang dami mga negosyante na malalaki. Yeah. And one of the guys who really helped me make that decision, si, ano, si Robert. Yeah, Robert si Robert Tan. Stan. Robert uh, S. Stan. Yeah, na blade. Uh, Oh, so, na- nakuwento mo nga yun no, na nag nagseek ka ng advice sa kanya and oh, oh, of from wisdom talaga. Napaka napakabait at napaka-humble, di ba? Na interview na rin natin yan both sa show oh, oh. at sa VIP TV. Uh, correct, correct, correct. So, and and ako ang ganda nung sinabi niya sa akin na and ayan, siya yung isa ah, sa t- kinausap ko. And, and kinausap nakausap ko rin si na tapos ano, 
eh, hindi pa pala nun. Sa si Robert lang muna ang kinausap ko tapos isang uh, kaibigan kinausap ko rin si Fre- uh, Frederico Moreno. Yeah, yung, yeah. Uh, si Fred. Si, oh, si Fred Moreno. Yeah. So, magaling rin na entrepreneur and uh, best friend kasi ng kuya ko yun eh. Okay. So, alam mo, okay. marami na silang pinagdaanan. So, as talaga ako, what do you think? What do you think? I took so many information that they that they gave me. I have it on my plate. And that's when we decided. Okay. So, doon that, talaga. That's gusto mo na talaga at you're ready. Yun na yun. Yun nakita uh, ko. Kasi, um, the, ang iniisip ko kasi noon, was I ready for that? Yeah, yeah. I, if... If I need to acquire certain skills that I need to acquire, gagawin ko eh. Oh. So, but the problem was, noong time na yun, as a network marketer for almost two decades, bro, of doing network marketing, yun yung core, ano ko eh. Yun na ginagawa yung, mo. Oh, oh. Ko eh. Kaya lang, I'm going out of that and do, gonna do management eh. Yeah, yeah. Oh. And, Iba yun eh. Iba kasi yun eh. Oh. And, yun yung gusto kong i, i, i ano sa mga tao hindi porket na hindi porket na ano ka cook ka you can open up a restaurant tama so, tama or skill yon ang ganda noon ha pero same thing with me i'm a, as a network marketer i needed to go out i needed to put on the management hat yeah the businessman hat kasi kailangan ko muna ng iba kasing structure yung tapapatakbuhin ko. Tama, tama. To make the, eh, sorry bro, ako medyo madaldala. Pero, <laughs> okay lang. We're learning bro. We're learning a lot. Thanks man. So, yun yun nangyari sa akin. So, I seek advice. I, I talk to to these spe, two specific people that I trust and I and I know that will give me the right answer as well. And I know that they will tell me, ano rin, uh, they, they will not be that nice. Alam yeah, mo yun? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tama. Sabi nila na parang, hindi, hindi, wag na, wag mo nang gawin. Tama, tama. But all, everything was, ano eh, was, was, it was God-given, man. I yeah. mean, it fell into place. It fell into place. Everything, the products, the business, the people. Yeah. Very important, guys. Kahit ang ganda ng product mo, ang ganda ng business plan mo, if you don't have the right people, tama. it's still gonna collapse. Tama, so tama. I believe I have a, a solid core, leader, core leaders. I have a solid team with me from network marketing, from management. I believe, sabi ko nga, I, I, I feel na yung team na na-create namin is talagang ano eh, tawag nga namin, dream team eh. Oh, oh. Dream team talaga siya. Kasi it's, and naging specific ko ng trabaho namin. Yun yung nagustuhan ko. Okay, okay. Oh. To create a team, it has to be specific kung ano yung trabaho ng isa't isa. Hindi Para hindi nag-overlap, hindi yan. Oo. Oh. Hindi nagsasapaw. Hindi nagtuturoan, ganun. Oo, oh, di ba? Actually, bro, alam mo naman minsan na sakit eh. Hindi naman yung nagtuturoan, yung nagsisisihan. Yun, isa pa. Oo. Oh, oh. <laughs> so, yun. Doon nag-start. So, everything fell into place. Um, the, the science was clear. Tapos, uh, we were able to to come up with the company kaagad uh, in just a few months lang. So, we launched uh, last November. Uh, we, soft launching pa nun. Supposedly nga, dapat nung April yung... Oo, oh, 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 oh. yung Mega big launch. launch oh. so, kaya lang, eh, alam mo naman, nasa sitwasyon tayo ng okay. COVID. Yeah. But, nonetheless, um, I'm very happy on the growth of the company. I'm very happy with the growth of the team. Um, right now, we're... A, we're pivoting like any business right now nagpipivot nag nagaano nag nag-adjust lang oh totoo eh kami rin eh sa diba? driven even sa driven i know you guys are doing that even yeah. with, ano with filam alam yeah. ko nag ano rin eh nag nag-shift eh yeah. gumagawa tayo ng mga ibang platforms like this one who would have thought we will have our own shows right yeah nga eh oo oh, oh. may six figures may VIP TV who would have thought but this is part of the pivot that we i'm talking about yeah and I feel as entrepreneurs, we have to be that fast to move. Kasi nga, like what I said, we are not just deciding on our own. We're yeah. deciding for everyone who is under our team. That's true. Tama. Ang ganda ron, ang ganda ron. You know, bro, we're learning a lot. And I, we can, I can really feel that there's a lot of wisdom and from your experience and from your heart. You know, when, when people, or if people would want to connect with you, want to learn from you, probably be part of your company, how do they contact you? Okay, um, you can get in touch with me with, with numerous ways. Okay, you can get in touch with me personally, which is uh, Rich Paredes. You can check out my Facebook. Facebook, uh, okay. May kita mo yung mukha ko or may kita mo yung asawa ko doon. <laughs> oh, isa lang po asawa ko, so no. hindi <laughs> <yung> problema. Tapos, 
you can get in touch with me with um, with our website uh, VIP for you. Uh, naman, nice yes, uh, four. Num- the number four. Oh. VIP for you. Okay. VIP for you. Okay. Um, dot ph. So you can get in touch with the. No, makikita nyo po dun yung ano yung website namin. Okay. Um, you can also uh, get in touch with me in Facebook. We have VIP International there. Okay. And of course, like what uh, DJ mentioned, we also have a medium platform which is yung VIP TV. Okay. You can get okay. in touch with that. Uh, medyo kabo, ano lang yun eh. Recently lang namin linabas yun. Yeah. Was timely na we started that nung bago pa mag-COVID actually. Okay. Okay. Yung parang a few days, nag-lockdown na. Alam okay. mo okay. So, ano rin eh, um, it was a, a spur of the moment thing but uh, we're getting a lot of, and we're helping a lot of people there. They're yes, getting in touch with us, messaging us. Um, of course, different platforms, they want to learn from us. They want the opportunity as well. Kasi I believe this is the best time to really look into business. Yeah. Kasi may tanong sa akin eh, tama ba na mag-business ngayon? Alam mo, sagot ko lagi, 100% totally, you have yeah. to get into business. Yeah. You cannot expect other things right now. You cannot yeah. expect the government. I mean, the yeah. government is trying our be- trying their best to give as much ayuda as they can. Yeah. Pero hindi enough yun. Yun. Yeah. You have to you work. You, ha- you, have to, you have to stand up, guys, and work. Yeah. And yeah. the best way to do that is to get something, get into network marketing. I, I feel this is one of the best platforms that can help you. And I believe with the products that we have, with the business platform that we have, we can help you. Not just on the business side, but also in the personal development you side. You know, important. Oh, you know, important. Ako na nagsasabi sa inyo, hindi lalaki ang negosyo mo kung hindi ka lalaki. Tama kung yun. Kung hindi improve Maniwala ka. Take it from me, who went into a seven-year hiatus of not doing anything, figuring things yeah. out. But eventually, ang nakakatawa, no, pare, Magde-decide rin mo pala ako papunta doon. Pinatagal eh. mo pa. Pinatagal ko pa. <laughs> and that's what that's my message for the people now. Yeah, yeah. Papunta patagalin. Alam mo if you feel that you you're looking for something, if you feel that you feel that you want to learn from me, you want to learn from my company, if you feel that you want to be part of my company, wow, I'm welcoming you 100%. We'll help you out. Message us there. And nice. definitely, you, I, I'll have one of my guys, if not one of my guys, I will personally message you and talk to you and give you guidance. Galing, galing. Thank you very much for th- that uh, message, Rich. And actually, tatanong ko pa lang ano yung message mo dun sa, sa mga tao. No? And we got that very fruitful message. Tarang nabasa mo na yung isip ko eh. Pero, one last question, bro. One last question. No, if you are, if you don't have any business and you're starting right now, mag-decide ka. Uh, wala. Pero meron ka ng experience and all those things na natutunan mo. You have the network and everything. Yeah. What business will you do right now and why? Wow, that's a very good question, man. I would probably, uh, if I am going to do a different business, oh my God. I know that's the thing with me. When I, kasi I, I never entertained any other business. So network marketing pa rin. Network marketing. Yeah, wala namang problema. Hindi ko naman sinabing kailangan baguhin. Eh. Kasi, <laughs> actually, that's, that's a test eh. Kung mag-change of heart ka ba. Or, and, yeah. and then, pero ano, honestly, yeah. If there would be, if there would be a, a different business that I would be doing, it's still gonna be connected with some sort, some in some way. It still, it will be, still be part of network marketing. Okay. It okay. could be. I could be into training. Yeah. Definitely. Or I could uh, yeah. be. Or I can be somebody who can provide the the support system for somebody okay. who is into network marketing. Okay, because you love the the people, you love the you know, the, the the system, ganun, you know. Yeah. I honestly, I I love people. Siguro, yeah. and probably, ito sa gudin ko lang rento. I mean, I I know you didn't ask this, but one of the reasons why I stayed in network marketing, number one, is because of the people. I yeah. just love people. I love. I love the growth of people. I love nurturing people. I love talking to people. For obviously, yeah. through this, <laughs> this <laughs> meeting natin, yeah. through this ano, interview, I, you, obviously, you know I love I That's true. value to people. And, and that is siguro, that is one of the, the, the key strengths that I have. Kasi kahit ano pang pinagdadaanan ng isang tao, kahit ano pang ugali, parang gagawa ako ng gagawa ng way to connect with this person. And if I need, if I need to be the person who opens up 
his mind, his heart, or basically let him hear what he needs to hear, I will sacrifice myself to be that person for them to grow better. Grabe, grabe. That, that's so much love and passion to people in this industry is really uh, what I can feel. Actually, tatanong ko yun eh, pero obviously, yun na nga yun eh, in, in seven years, obviously you love and you're enjoying. That's why you just cruised along probably, yun nga, naging fans club ka lang. Uh, oh but eventually that decision made that shift. You know, we learned a lot from you, Rich. Thank you very much for your time. Uh, and you guys, whatever you're learning from this video and from Rich, kindly comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe in my channel. Also, um, share this video and tag your friends. So that you know that people who will benefit from this video, tag them and make, them, make sure that they will watch this. And don't forget to follow me, follow us in Facebook. This is TJ Demaliwat. And of course, Rich Paredes of VIP TV and VIP International. Thank you very much for watching and see you again soon.